player batting in the same slot as they were yesterday. Last night, I should say, but this ball blasted back deep. Gone! Luis Allen gets it up and over the wall and left and gives Nicaragua a 2-0 lead. Living and dying with every pitch. And now a ball crushed to left field, and that's going to tie the game. That got out of here in a hurry. Hanging curve, belt high, middle. Ooh. Sweet swing. Try to qualify for the Olympic Games. Montiel, though, with a base hit into left field. One run is in. Here's the throw to the plate. Tie game. Montiel racing for second. He'll slide in safely. It's 5-5 five to five in the top of the eighth. A pinch hit, two-run single. Fletcher left it hanging out there, belt high. Beyond the dive of Ozzy Martinez. 1-1 one, one pitch. In the dirt, it gets past Arroyo. Nicaragua with a 6-5 lead. A wild pitch to snap the tie. Off the right leg of Michael Arroyo. A man on second, it's Brandon Layton. Kellogg kicks and comes home on 1-1. One, one. And a little looper right side, a lunging grab by Wes Darville. Ends the Cuba threat in the second. That thing seemed ticketed for shallow right field and an RBI base hit for Santos. And instead, a pretty quick inning. Canada's had J.D. Osborne with a two-out walk in the fifth inning. There's a swing and a big drive off the bat of Michael Kraus to left center field. Moving back on it is Santos, and at the wall, he'll watch it go. That thing got out in a hurry. A hanging breaking ball, and Michael Kraus did not miss it. He loads that big frame and powers it out. That's a big run. I mean, that turns this game from a potential save situation. 47 appearances, 58 in the third innings pitch, 0.77 was his ERA. As this ball is driven well to left field, moving back on it is Palma to the warning track to the wall. It's all tied up at 2-2 in the ninth. And Jordan Diaz comes through with a game-tying homer just three pitches later. A banned substance, an illegal substance, I should say, on the glove of the reliever last inning as this ball is crushed to left, and it's not going to matter. The time home run in the top of the ninth inning off of the ejection is short-lived as Venezuela has won this one on a walk-off homer by Diego Rincones. Didn't even get a chance to run down the crazy events at the top of the ninth before Rincones wins it in the bottom half, and this one is over. Spent the bulk of 2013 with the Milwaukee Brewers, and he unloads on this one high and deep to right. That ball is gone. With one swing, he cuts the U.S. lead in half. It's a 2-1 game. We've seen more than a half dozen home runs hit in this ballpark through the first three games. This being the fourth in this tournament, that's the first one we've seen hit to right field. Maybe as little as a base hit will do it. The outfield's pretty deep, but Colesbury's thinking bigger. This ball's gone! Colesbury, a two-out, two-run homer. A 4-1 lead for the United States. Those two receiving equal congratulations as they get to the third base dugout. Radamus Lees missed his target. Here's a 1-1 pitch, hammered high and deep to left field. Williams is on the warning track and he'll watch it go. Goris gives his teammates and the Dominican fans a thrill. They have their first lead of the night at five to four. 
urge their team to get something going. And this one's cranked out to left center. Oh man, that's another for Juan Francisco. Two run game, eight to six, nobody out, top of the ninth. 